I'm Divya from NTTF. Netto Technical Training Foundation, as one of the premier institution, cordially invites you all to join the webinar session. Today's webinar topic, International Diploma in IT and Data Science of NTTF with NCC Education with UK. NCC Education UK. Overview of NTT NCC International Diploma, Career Pathway Opportunities. To take us through the webinar session, we are privileged to have Ms. Esther Chesterman, GM NCC Education UK, and Mr. P.V. Sudarshan, Deputy Managing Director NTTF, as a speaker on the topic International Diploma in IT and IT Data Science of NTTF with NCC Education UK. So just before I have the session, I would like to remind like everyone to post your questions in the chat box and keep yourself in the mute mode. We will address it during the webinar session. To more details, you can visit our website www.nttftrg.com for more details. Now, I would request Sudarshan sir to start the session. Thank you. Okay. So let's get started. Please uh, keep mute yourself ask the questions at the end through the chat box so we will get started as we are already getting late um, once again uh, sorry for this uh, technical hit and once again i welcome all the participants to this webinar <clears throat> in next 30 minutes uh, which will give you a lot of insight and information about this international diploma how you can make this um, uh, career field seen students clearing the semester exams through webex microsoft teams zoom and other web based technology and it is indeed a rocky and shaky start for students as well as for education organization and whole education system the student sentiments are pretty low at this point of time as they are experiencing panic under this greatest ever pandemic we are facing through and a lot of uncertainty in front of the students. Uh, they don't know what will happen in the future. Nobody can predict the future very well at this point of time. A lot of uncertain things. So under these conditions of uncertainty, what a student should do, really, a lot of study, track of employment market trends. Both the parents and the students for research, research and read what kind of industry are healing today, what kind of corporate sectors are hiring people today, and what kind of jobs are in demand, and more importantly, what kind of skills that is required in the days to come. So with this unstable global economy and many people are looking for employment, it is imperative that one should know and be aware and updated on the future job trends and the skill demands. This webinar aims to give you an insight into the future jobs and the skills needed and how an international diploma which can fulfill your aspirations. So that's how the team future proof your career. So let's get started. What are the future? You people might have known, read in newspapers and internet and a lot of things. Internet and a lot of things. Machine learning, internet of things, a lot of things are happening. New technologies will evolve and will keep disrupting the uh, market and the market and the economy. So what one so should what one should do to keep technology as it comes? So some people might ask me, oh I don't know about data science. People are talking big whether I should invest time and effort in this and will it survive again after two years the new technology may come and completely take over data science. So a lot of questions are there. So many reputed organizations, institutes, and corporates have done a thorough study, and they believe for the next 10 years, some technologies will play a major role and create job market. 
those are data science artificial intelligence intelligence of things and so on things and so on so this is the right opportunity, the right opportunity to learn these new technologies and get an international technology can provide a, a global a global identity of what we have done is we have seamlessly continuously kept pace with the change in technology so we have collaborated many with the leading industries such as cisco uipath intel and we have kept updating our syllabus so that our students will always learn what is relevant today and for tomorrow for example machine learning ai cyber security is all part of our syllabus already so we are making our already future ready one more important thing i want to stress upon today is if we take india's average age is about 28 and that too the age between 16 and 25 is about 65 percent of our population so whereas if you compare with the um, <clears throat> developed countries like japan and germany the average age is about 48 and us and uk is about 40. so that means these countries will face a lot of challenge in kind of skilled and power. So which is, uh, which is India on top because of this demographic, demographic advantage. How this modern technology and the skills, then the world is open for the students who learn this technology and go with it. And today, we are proud to be an accredited partner of NCC, National Computing Center, UK, to offer international diploma in India to our Bangalore campus. The more details of about NCC and other international opportunities, Ms. Esther <coughs> will give more details after my presentation, so please kindly wait. So in the next few slides, I want to take you through about what is NTTF and what all the offerings and how it can make a difference. So NTTF started 60 years ago in 1959 in a place called Netur in Kerala. That's how NTTF name comes. NTTF means Netur Technical Training Corporation. It's a non-profit organization and started with the CIS government to uh, impart skilling in India. Then we started with the 20 students uh, in one center, and today we have spread across India, India with more than 50 locations of operations and 50 core centers offering diploma programs. So 20 students uh, um, developing skills, we have come to 20,000 skills today. And in and very well respected. And as a brand for top placement. So, as I said, since 1959, um, industry technology focus program that is our unique strength and pan India pros, uh, presence. And we have 800 plus dedicated trainers. Each trainer undergo 18 months of rigorous training before they can take a single class. That means you learn from the capable trainer. So this is a snapshot of our All India presence. As you can see, um, we are spread across India, length and breadth. And we offer on the right side, you see the centers offering the diploma program that is a three-year program of diploma. Not only this, NTTF is continuously trying um, <clears throat> to expand our presence in India. A lot of other two centers are in discussion. And also, uh, overseas uh, training center uh, are also on the end. NTTF <clears throat> offers these programs, which is a three years program. Uh, this is basically for the 10th standard students, all the diploma programs, except 
information technology and data science, which is the key focus for today's webinar. So we also offer other diploma programs, tool engineering, mechatronics, electronics, computer, and electrical and electronics. Whereas information and technology and data science require a 12th standard or an ITI entry to this. We have diploma programs. There are, we have forged relationship with a lot of universities to offer bachelor and vocational education. That is, a student with a plus two, that is a one standard qualification, joins our diploma, they have a chance to parallelly pursue bachelor degree with the leading universities like Dianan University, Bellur Institute of Technology, Jain University, and etc. So we continuously try to rope in many benefits to the students. Apart from this, we also have a post diploma program one year program in spy discipline, including the IT infrastructure. NTTF also runs postgraduate program. This is after one and two years program in tool engineering, product design, vehicle product development, tool design and quality engineering management. As today's program focuses on uh, IT and science, if people are interested about the other programs, kindly visit our website, which for you all the relevant information. One of the features of NTTF, NTTF is continuously investing uh, in new technologies and also collaborating with the leading industries to offer the relevant technology and training in the current scenario. For example, uh, we have invested in a center of excellence for 3D printing with the Stratasys machines to offer 3D printing uh, training, as well as prototype to the industry, which is making a significant uh, difference in the medical industry, and of course, in other industries as well. We have tied up with the Bosch for Industry 4.0, wherein the learner not only get the hands-on experience on the new technology like IoT, uh, machine learning and other things, but also will learn from the Bosch experts, both at NTTF and also they have a chance to visit the Bosch facility to learn how Industry 4.0 is implemented. So this is just to mention that NTTF keep focusing on the new technologies and will rope in the leading industries to impart the best international training at par with any other great institutes. So this is some of the examples of the leading industry collaboration, like um, we are authorized support center for Cisco, academic support center for Cisco, offering cybersecurity and uh, related training. And we are one of the top in Asia uh, for uh, Cisco. And also we have a center of excellence for Intel to import IoT machine learning, artificial intelligence. And we have tied up with Amazon for cloud and big data, but you know, for RPM, Siemens for PLC, DSC, and, and so many things. So all these people have uh, worked with us and we have made our syllabus in line with the, this leading industry uh, requirement and these people have also provided the valuable content so that our students can learn the latest available thing in the world. of NTTF is the training, just not only on the technical things, but also on the life skills, communication, and other industry practices. And everyone uh, learns through a laptop. There is no <coughs> tech, uh, textbook. Everything is loaded into the cloud. They can download and learn at their pace and uh, <laughs> at the same time it's on exposure to the people so this is what we call it as with the continuous evaluation and our academic council is um, consisting of industry specialists and of and we review once in six months so is known for the placements. All the placements happen at our campus. Most of the students get placed, more than 95%. Those students don't get placed either 
they study uh, further education or a lot of people have become their own entrepreneurs. Uh, we have a lot of cases of entrepreneurship in India and abroad as well and doing very well. And our alumni is spread across the globe, as you can see in the right hand side, from Singapore to the USA, naming all the different countries. So this is a partial list of recruiters who come to NTTF um, for their uh, selection of people and recruitment happens around the year in the final year of, of the students here in the third year. For example, even in the COVID times, um, uh, come recruit and um, not in single digits or whatever, it's in three digits, 100 and 200 numbers, uh, people have recruited from NTT. I just want to quote some of the examples of the alumni. One of the alumni, Amrita, she heard about NTTF is good for placement and just trusted someone and blindly joined NTTF and took the Diploma in Information Technology course. So she got placed in LNT Infotech in the sixth <coughs> semester itself. And today she's doing excellent in Appinex and dealing with a lot of client projects, both in India and abroad. As she says, she has gained a lot of uh, practical knowledge from excellent faculties. <clears throat> One more example, Suryakant uh, coming from Kannur in Kerala. See, as you see in India, people aspire for um, after plus two, either engineering or a medical. So a lot of peer pressure to pursue this. But Suryakant decided to do an entity of diploma as he heard for the value from his uh, uh, peers and entity of um, uh, known uh, fraternities. And he decided to do a diploma in information technology in Bangalore. So he traveled from Kannur and spent three years in Bangalore campus and achieved the diploma in information technology and started. And he got selected in the sixth semester as well with LG Soft. And today he's at Deloitte uh, doing exceedingly well. So a lot of case studies of alumni who have doing exceedingly well after NTTF diploma and achieved greater heights in their life. So NTTF is well known for it. So summing up, the NTTF USP, we have now an international diploma from NCC UK. And the students will also get an NSQF certificate from the Ministry of Skill Development and Entrepreneurship. And three year diploma is well known. It is a brand uh, well known in the industry, and uh, corporates keep looking for entity of students. And we have an option, as I explained, a concurrent BVOC degree from reputed Indian universities. And also, an online degree possible now sitting in India. <laughs> industry across India, as explained. And there is an opportunity for B tech programs for the lateral entry. A lot of universities take our entity of diploma and the lateral entry uh, into their engineering stream. So this is an accredited partnership certificate of NCC. So when we decided that we should prepare Indian youth to the international level in the in the IT sector, so we approached NCC uh, whether we can collaborate. And NCC had done the due diligence and after rigorous assessment, uh, they have accredited NTTF as their partner in India. So we can offer L3 to L5 diploma under NCC. Now we will focus on L5 diploma. What it basically means is a student joins uh, an NTTF for a three year diploma in. Uh, in <clears throat> in information technology and data science and the parallelly register with so at the end of the three years so the student will get both entity of diploma and level five diploma uh, from the ncc uk and there are a lot of opportunities after level five which Ms. esther will explain in a presentation So get both the certificates. One is entity of diploma, and the other one is um, the level five diploma uh, from NCC UK. 
So if people uh, want to know about further details, you can visit us on the website. And there are a lot of information in the website. And we are open for online admission because in the COVID times, there are restrictions of travel. So we are helping people to register online and take the admission online to all of the diploma programs. So make use of this opportunity. With this, um, I will hand over to um, Ms. Esta for our presentation. I will shortly share my screen as well. Over to you, Ms. Esta. Thank you very much. Can you all hear and see me? Yes, good. And I think um, Darcy can share my slide. Greetings to everybody from England. From England. I'm sat in I'm my sat home in office my in Cambridge, which is um, some, somewhere I'm sure you've all heard of, as Cambridge University is very famous around the world. It's a great pleasure I join you and NTTF for this webinar um, and I have the opportunity to share a little bit about NCC education and presentation that Mr Sudarshan has just given. So um, NCC Education is an organisation that was founded in 1966 and for those of you who are a little bit younger than me it would be a great surprise that there was an organisation looking at computing in the 1960s. <laughs> computing is, is, has a long history. Um, if you could just move on to the next slide. So this is our mantra. Our vision is to educate, inspire and grow. And education is obviously at the heart of what we do. Um, we like to think our programmes are inspiring and inspire our learners and our students to move on to reach their potential and to grow, to grow into the industries, the sectors, the careers that they are aspire. So this is our mantra and something um, that we believe very strongly in. And also we felt aligned very closely with NTT that Mr. Sudarshan has just explained a minute ago. Next slide, please. Could I have the next slide, please? Thank you. So, as I said, we were set up by the UK government in 1966. Um, and originally we were set up to help deliver computing education. So we have a long history and a long deep understanding of computing and obviously have um, leveraged that throughout the years. We have a network now of over 170 educational partners in many, many parts of the world. Um, and that's very important to us because it also means that the qualification that you have has currency and value in many countries. So if you are looking to explore the world, particularly once we're over the COVID situation, then your certificate will be recognised and understood wherever you go. So we work mainly with international schools, colleges, and we have a wide university partnership, which I'll talk about in a while. Um, again, this adds a lot of um, credence and a lot of status to our qualification because we have many partners who are well established in their country and universities that have high world rankings so that you have the confidence that the qualification you have has good learning underpinning what it is that you are gaining. We are a global provider, and that means working locally, but also online. Um, many of our partners deliver online, either in a blended way or solely online. And we also have an online top-up degree, which Mr Sudarshan discussed, which is with the University of Central Lancashire. And I'll talk about that a little bit further in the presentation. Next slide, please. We ourselves are a global company, so our head office, is in Manchester, which is again somewhere you'll probably know. Most people know Manchester because of the football. So that's where our head office is. We have an office in South Africa. We have an office in Beijing, in China, in Kuala Lumpur, in Malaysia and in Singapore. So we have a real global reach, which means we can draw on lots of different mm -hmm. organisations. Um, we have an industry panel, which verifies our qualifications, mm -hmm. making sure they are relevant to the current and we can draw on people from all different parts of the world. Gina. 
Thank you. If we can move to the next slide, please. This is just a small taste of where all of our 170 partners are. We're in over 50 countries. Um, you can also, as a um, graduate of NCC Education, join our alumni network on LinkedIn, which is a large growing network. This network would allow you to actually discuss and talk with other alumni from NCC Education. And that could be a great opportunity for networking. Um, many of our partners are people who have moved on to become entrepreneurs, as Mr. Sudarshan wow. said, who have moved on to very large Bluetooth organizations. Hello. People Hello. who have complete qualifications similar to you. Next slide, please. This is just a short slide that just talks about our milestones. So we've obviously adapted and changed as an organization over the years. We've introduced different types of programs to make sure we meet with the market demand. We've also moved into some school qualifications and we also have higher education qualifications as well. And it also discusses in 2007 when we partnered with our universities to gain our university degree pathways. Next slide, please. So Mr. Sudarshan has already referred quite a lot to the world really that we're in at the moment and the world that we're looking at in the future. A little bit of a scan of the internet, it's very clear that computing and IT qualifications are really going to be the ones that stand you out from the crowd around a career, a career that was future proof, a career really that will move you into the future with a lot of confidence around the career that you would like to have. There's many, many different roles within computing and IT. The education qualification gives you a foundation. Partnering with an organization such as NTTF, we felt that was a really good marriage of very practical vocational qualification skills with the academic rigor and the academic robustness that the education qualification gives you as well. And that really then is something that secures your career and makes you adaptable, makes you very relevant and really stands you out from the crowd because we are becoming quite competitive in the computing sector. To have an NCC education diploma and an NTTF diploma means you've got quite a lot that makes you more competitive in the market as you move Hello. forward after you graduate. Next slide, please. So what does make us different, makes us unique? There are many different UK, British qualifications. NCC Education is one of the few that are off-qual regulated. We're specialists in computing, and we're one of the only specialist computing awarding organisations that are off-qual regulated. Off-qual is the Office for Qualifications, which is part of the UK government. They have very strict standards around the, de the delivery of the qualifications, the design of the qualifications, and the way that we operate with our partners. So again, it gives you the confidence that your qualification has the off-call stamp on it. And that is globally recognized. So again, when you have your certificate, the currency and value of that certificate is secured, backing by off-call, knowing that it has the quality assurance of the UK government behind it. Also on the framework, which is the regulation and the quality framework. This means that your qualification can be mapped against other qualifications of the same level. We have a full academic board and we have a full academic team who oversee the quality of our qualifications, who oversee the design and the delivery of our assessments to make sure that they are adaptable and that they meet the needs of the universities but also that they give you the skills that you need and the practice you need when you move into employment. Because of the rigour and the quality of our qualifications, we've been able to partner with over 70 universities globally, not only here in the UK, but in many other And it's with organisations such as NTTF that we have managed to develop our network of centres. A very practical organisation with high quality trainers 
and very high quality facilities where we felt confident that our programmes could be delivered at the quality that we require. That students who graduate from NTTF with the NTTF diploma and the NCC education diploma can have a choice of moving into an academic stream or into employment with both those skills there ready to be applied either in the workplace or in further. Next slide, please. Thank you. So one of the benefits of NCC education is our flexibility. So students study locally at a partner centre such as NTTF and they can study their level five diploma alongside their diploma from NTTF. We then have options for students and depending on your um, situation, what is, whether you're looking to go into work and then come back to gain your degree, whether you're looking to go abroad to finish your degree or whether you want to stay locally and complete your degree from NTTF, the local partner. We have many options there and that flexibility is really important. So if it is something you want to do about going abroad to study your final year of your degree, we have many partners who would accept the NCC education diploma and the NTTF education diploma and that you could then move into your final year at one of our partner universities. However, NTTF have also been accredited as a partner for our online top up degree. That's our degree with the University of Central Lancashire. So students who complete the NCC education diploma with NTTF can stay in their home country and through NTTF and NCC education complete their UK degree without leaving India, if that is right for them. So the level five, that's fine, you can move on, thank you. The level five diploma in computing and business IT, um, Mr. Sudarshan has already explained a little bit of the diploma. It's part of our degree pathway and it's one of the qualifications that NTT have, have been um, assigned to deliver. And we've obviously been through the approval and the quality process with them. This programme has been developed with a wide range of university lecturers, university personnel to make sure it's academically strong, but also through our industry panel that it has relevance to the current computing market and that sector. So students will feel confident that their qualification gives them the skills to or higher education. Next slide, please. The computing pathway, we begin at level four on to level five. Students at NTTF will be looking at level five only at the moment. Level five diploma is the equivalent to year two of a UK degree. So once you've finished your level five diploma, you can, as I said, move on to a degree top up, either in the UK or one of our other partner universities in Canada, Australia or New Zealand. All students can stay at NTTF and complete an online top up through the University of Central Lancashire and that way they can stay still gain a UK degree or have the option to move abroad if they would like. So university progression, this is one of our real strengths. We have a university partnership team who work very closely with a wide range of universities. And you can see the different flags there, of the different universities who recognize our qualification and recognize it as entry onto their degree pathways. If you click on the link when you have the slides, you'll be able to see our full range of different pathways that we have. In NCC education, students who complete the level five can gain their Bachelor of Science Honours degree from the University of Central Lancashire. This is a one year top up, which students can then perform online with some support from NTTF, whether it's study support or some of the work that you can do at NTTF. Or the deliveries from UK professors and UK lecturers delivered online and recorded. So you have lots of ways of engaging with the education. The degree says exactly the same as a degree if you had studied on campus at the University of Central Lancashire. And students can go to the campus if they would like. Graduation. And we have many students who come to the graduation in central Lancashire and we attend as well. It's a great pleasure to meet all our students all around the world who studied the online degree top up and gave their, gained their Bachelor of Science. That's London Bridge. So we are a very UK brand. We work closely with the Department of International Trade. 
We were the Federation of Awarding Bodies Exporter of the Year last year. We were very proud of that award. And we are part of the UK government's Exporting is Great campaign. So we work very closely with the UK government to ensure that we are providing British education globally. So with NTTF, as I've said, there are many options. So you'll be able to gain your Bachelor of Science, Business Computing and Information Systems degree online by NCC Education and NTTF. Or you can move to one of our partner universities and we have Scotland, England, Australia and New Zealand. So if your desire is to move abroad for your final year, then there are options for you to do that with your NCC Education and NTTF qualification. Each of those universities are very different. They are either campus university, the university that specialises in engineering or computing, a university that specialises in data science, or the one in New Zealand, a university that specialises in employment and placement. So there's many options and your NTTF staff will help you in looking at which option is right for you, whether it's to stay in India for your bachelor's or whether it's to move abroad for your final year. And that's a lot of people graduating very happily. We are at the stage at the moment in NCC education cycle where we have many graduations happening. Unfortunately, most of these are online, so we are not able to attend them. But I really hope that in the future, I'll be able to come to NTTF and see a large number of you graduating from the NCC education diploma and from the NTTF education diploma. So thank you very much for having me. And I hope you found my presentation interesting. Hello. Thank you, Mr. Uh, Krishnan. Thank you, Esther. I'm just going to curate a few questions right now, and I'll hand it over to Divya after this. We have a couple of questions coming in, and most popular question that comes is from a few current students and alumni. And how do current students? How can they get this kind of this accreditation? Is it applicable to them? Uh, if so, how do they go about getting it? This seems to be a popular question among current students and alumni. Go to you, yeah. we, we, I can answer that. Sure. So we have um, defined a pathway for the alumni um, uh, to take up this level five diploma. So they need to take a, a bridging module uh, and then clear it and take an L. If it is possible, uh, through NTTF and NCC, we can do it for the alumni. Whereas the current students uh, who are coming to second year, uh, we are in discussion with NCC how to manage these modules within the next two years. So it is also a possibility. Whereas in the third year, we need to take a call whether we consider them as alumni or uh, give the, all, all the modules in one year. So, hello, sir. In short, alumni are possible, second year entry is possible. Those who are coming to third year this year, they may have to take after uh, the completing the diploma L5. So all are possible. There are different pathways to do the level five diploma. Level five diploma. Thank you, sir. Uh, Thank you, a couple sir. of people are coming to ask, for the, ask the questions over the mic. Request you to post the questions on the chat. Uh, there are a few questions coming. I'm taking the questions and presenting to the speaker. So please use the chat, send the questions to me through that. Thank you. Uh, the next question that we have is um, where can they go and find the information about the fees for this like extra uh, uh, fees that they need to pay or uh, uh, what they need to pay for the additional NCC diploma? Those who are standing in NTTF, they, they can contact this um, course in charge, CP09. They will be able to guide them. Thank you, sir. Um, the next question that we have, uh, this is about what kind of job opportunities are there? Opportunities are there? And what kind of accreditation is there for CC abroad for uh, you know uh, job opportunities? Maybe Esther can answer that. Ah, yes. I mean, if you joined our LinkedIn alumni, you'd see that there's a wide variety of different um, job opportunities and um, areas that our alumni have moved into. Um, there's many different um, roles in computing um, and the 
the um, UCLAN business science, business, science information, business technology information technology degree. Technology. It's something that really something is a foundation that really degree foundation. that gives you a lot of choice. We've had many people move into um, software development, many move into data science. So it's an opportunity for you to really and look at cloud computing, AI. There's so many new systems coming through at the moment. And the degree really gives you the options to do the options to do the options to do the options to I'd advise any student who is looking into the diploma or looking into the pathway to really have a look around at the time careers that are open. Make sure that they are. There's a lot of background noise. Hello. I'd advise them to do a little bit of careers. Do a little bit of online to make sure that the area that they're looking to explore is one that they have the skills and the ability to do. But with NTTF support and the qualification from NCC education, really there's many, many different roles in that sector. So, that sector. so I'd look at the line so on, 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 on the line to really explore what types of what type of start to get some connections. Get some connections. Uh, let me take on the next question. Uh, we have a couple of more questions on the chat. Please use the chat to ask your questions. Um, if in case you face some technical delay, please use the chat. The next question that we have is, uh, is this like a lateral entry process or we still have to complete have three, to complete three years three again with NCC? Years. Hello, so sir. It is a concurrent program. So the people who are joining NTTF Diploma, um, yes, within three years, they get an NTTF Diploma as well as from NCC UK in three years. Okay, no, this is open for a 12th standard and ITI. So basically it is for 12 standards of education. Yes, sir, ITI, yes, sir. ITIs can also do this. And they put exams. So please, post, the... please post your questions on chat. Uh, do not unmute and speak. Please post your questions on chat. It will be easy for me to moderate. Uh, we'll take a couple of more questions before we we turn it over to Divya for the closure. Um, another question that we have is uh, just a minute. Sir, okay, sir. Sir, what is the entity of plan and arm program? Uh, this is not the right uh, forum for that. Please hold on to your question. Uh, we have one more question that's coming in, which is uh, what about final year trainees having eligibility? The current final year trainees, are they also eligible for this? I did, I did answer. So there are different pathways for um, each um, student who are studying in NTTF diploma, okay? So everybody can get an L5, but there are different pathways. For the alumni, they have uh, uh, bridging modules, and for those who are joining now, they will go through all the modules in the three years, and those who are entering second year, there is a different pathway. So all can take L5, whoever joins NTTF diploma can take this L5 diploma from NCC. Uh, NTTF, uh, NTTF plus sir. Please use the chat forum to ask the questions. Uh, yes, sir, the question is for you. Uh, for an alumni, will the exams for NCC, will it be online or is there any centers that they have to go and take it? This is for entity of alumni, if they have to approach this. So is this for alumni from NTTF who are looking to gain the NCC education? So those students who have completed their um, study of learning, perhaps one or two years ago, can actually contact NTTF and they will advise them on the best route for them to gain the top up if they're top up degree. There may be, as Martian said, a couple of units they need to do as bridging units to enable them to then move on to the um, UCLAN top up, but that's perfectly doable. We can work with you and the centre to make sure you have the opportunity to do that. Uh, thank you, Esther. Uh, one final question. Uh, this is uh, might be a very trivial question, but I think it will help the students to understand. 
uh, we are referring to L5. Uh, I think some of them are asking about what is this L5? Uh, maybe yeah, that's a very good point. Um, so the regulatory quality framework, the RQF, if you wanted to Google it and look it up, that's a UK and an, an international regulatory qualification framework. So that basically aligns all the qualifications of, around the world to make sure that you have an understanding of what your diploma is in another diploma from another country. So a level five diploma on the RQF is equivalent to the second year of a degree in the UK. So a level four is the first year of your degree and a level five is the second year of the degree. So that's on the UK government qualification framework. A level five is the equivalent to a second year of a UK degree. It's a qualification in its own right. You can finish after your level five level five diploma on your resume and that's acknowledged and understood of what that means or you can top it up and then, gain the, full and then degree. gain the full degree. Hello, hello, miss. Uh, thank you, sir. Uh, I think that's all the questions that we have. Maybe, uh, Sushin, if you can just give them an alternate place where they can get the information and we can pass it on to the VR pros. All the information um, <coughs> is available in nttfprg.com. Uh, they can go to the website, and there are a lot of center details are also. They can contact the contact electronics, the electronics, and they they will get they, all the details. Thank you, Sushant. Uh, over to you, Divya, for the closure. Um, Thank you, Ms. Thank you for Varadarajan, sir, uh, for the question answer sessions. Uh, now we are in the concluding uh, part. Thank you, Ms. Esther and Mr. B.V. Sudarshan for this wonderful webinar session. Hope everybody has got the good information and uh, they can uh, visit our website for the further information. That is www.nttftig.com. Now we have at NTTF are confident that this slide will pass and we will progress. We wish you and your family safety, the best of health, and the happiness. Thank you all for attending the webinar. Stay home, stay safe. Thank you. Thank you very much, everybody. Thank you.